uh, in this particular video uh, we will be looking at uh, why uh, radian is a constant angle and for that you have to take the uh, ratio of uh, two angles and uh, that would be what we will be doing here and uh, this particular angle, angle theta uh, as uh, a o p <coughs> it's having a radian which that is uh, it's on radians which simply means that the arc over here so if it's a uh, this radius of this particular circle so the arc over here is also having the same measure and uh, uh, the second angle we will be looking at is the uh, angle a o b that is the straight angle that's this particular angle of course it's uh, 180 degrees that is so uh, uh, so we would be looking at that particular ratio that is uh, angle AOP by angle AOB and of course the first one is uh, say, uh, radian measure so it is R by pi R because we are taking half of a circle that is so uh, it will be 2 pi R by 2 <coughs> that is pi R so it simply means that uh, you are getting uh, 1 by pi. That simply means that, uh, of course, angle AOP is 1 by pi times angle AOB. It simply means that angle AOP is angle AOB by pi. And the important point is that uh, AOB, that is the straight angle, and pi are both, both these values are constant. So, uh, because uh, AOB angle, AOB, which is the straight angle, that is uh, 180 degrees, and uh, so because in this particular case, AOB is angle AOB and pi are constants which simply means that the radian measure is a constant so so the radian measure is actually a, dealing with a constant angle thank you